making of uh, The Natural because, you know, it's really mm-hmm. one of those uh, 90s gems, you know what I'm saying, that people talk mm-hmm. about, should talk about a lot more. Um, and, the, you know, the list of producers is amazing from Beat Miners to Mark Sparks, mm-hmm. you know, Herb, mm-hmm. Chai Skills, Buck Wild. Mm-hmm. Um, yo, Not was shame. the album... Well, word that she and Marik on the remix. Yo, yeah. was it always designed to have a uh, you know a collective of producers kind of like Illmatic, or was Herb supposed to take the reins on it, so to speak, and and, and do it himself? Well, initially he had wanted he wanted to do the lion's share of it, um, mm-hmm. and then we had gotten to a conflict in terms of me signing directly to him versus me signing to the label. And I right. opted not to sign with him. Um, yeah. So, but he, but even though that didn't happen, he still, you know, had an intricate part in terms of, you know, making that album. The dilemma that, not so much the dilemma, but I think the, the thing that we were kind of, sort of at odds with was I wanted, you know, I wanted a, a album that embodied what I knew. You know, and mm-hmm. what I knew was Pete sound and large sound and 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 premier sound. Like those were the that dirty the producers. Yeah, yeah they, they were the ones at that time that you know they inspired me to want to do shit. And I wanted to work <clears throat> and the beat miners as well, primarily with them. Right. You know, and um, coming off that Smith and Wesson and all that shit. Yeah. Right, right, and yeah. it wasn't so much what they did. It was just more so they me as an it. artist, and that production was kind of that was my school of production. Right, and Gotti had more of an idea to try to create a hybrid of like Death Row, but on the East Coast. And right, right. Th- that would have been cool if you know the production was at the at the caliber of the death row, but it wasn't. So mm-hmm. it it kind of had me where I was like, all right, well, I know I want to do this with Buck, and I know I want to do this with Large, and I know I want to do this with Shy, right. and I know I want to do this with X, Y, and Z. So we did it that way, and he still, because there's songs he did that didn't make, you know, the final album, but there's songs that a couple people did that didn't make the final album. But in the end, you know, he still ended up doing a great deal. 